This is the full list of missing supplies, sir. Hmm. They weren't here for that long, but they managed to steal quite a bit. It's impressive, certainly. Huh? But an operation like this would have been impossible without an inside man. Of course, the resistance. We need extra rope on the starboard side. Check the landing crafts. Get those engines ready to run. That should be all the supplies loaded, sir. We're just about done with refueling, too. It would appear we're almost ready for the grand finale. Do you think Squad E will be back in time for departure? It certainly would be a problem if they missed the boat. From here on out, we'll be racing against time itself. I can understand wanting to thank the Resistance. We wouldn't have these supplies without them. But Operation Cygnus is our greatest priority. I do hope Mr. Wallace is aware of that. But there's still the issue with our main reactor. Brian, would you mind accompanying me for a moment? Well, I'll be. Ain't every day I see you wandering around down here. Thought you'd taken root in the bridge. <laughs> You're as chipper as always, Andre. It's nice to see you in person once in a while. Orders over the intercom just aren't the same. So, what's the occasion? I reckon you didn't come all the way down here just to talk to an old grease monkey. Yeah, I have business in the Forbidden Sector. I'm sorry. But I'm afraid I'll have to... Yeah, I figured. The main reactor hasn't made a peep since that mess. Come on, Roland. I know there's some kind of secret with that reactor. Can't you let me in on it? I'm sorry, old friend. I'm afraid that's not something I can do, even for you. Good grief. Fine, fine. I guess it's up to you to get that thing working again, huh? Well, shall we? Oh. The reactor's still empty. Not much time left now. I understand, sir. I'll bring it back at once. No. It won't fully activate unless it's here of its own free will. That's what all the briefings said. Then... It'll have to return willingly. Until then, we wait. Do you think it will return, sir? Will it come back for us? <sighs> such a beautiful city before all this. This neighborhood resisted occupation the hardest. When the Imperials came, they destroyed everything. I can see Imperial patrols all over the place. See that building next to the central plaza? Yeah. That's where General Manuel is being held captive. He's an important contact we had within the Empire. He's been accused of cooperating with the Resistance. They've taken him in for questioning. Was it because of the supplies we took in that op earlier? Yes, but they won't find any evidence. He's an influential figure in the Empire. Ordinarily, he'd be questioned for a day or two, then acquitted. But this time we got unlucky. The one leading the investigation is Major Burke. A real witch hunter. 
practically a one-man inquisition. He's held a grudge against Manuel for a while now. The General interfered with one investigation too many. He'd fabricate whatever evidence he needed if it would push Manuel towards a death sentence. Sounds like a real charmer. Why don't we just take out all the soldiers around here? That'd be quicker, right? No. Even if we liberated the city, the Imperials would be here in days to take it back, with more troops than ever. If that happened, I don't know if the Resistance could hold them off on their own. We work in the shadows. We don't have the raw power to fight the Imperial Army head-on. That's why we're putting all our eggs in your basket. I know we're pushing the responsibility on you, but... That's not true at all. You're fighting the Empire just like us. Take pride in that. Thank you. Truth be told, I've got a baby on the way. My wife is due this spring. That's why I want this war over before then. That's why I'm fighting beside you. If our baby remembers hearing anything from these years, I want it to be birdsong, not gunfire. Sounds like a good future to me. And we'll be the ones to make it happen. Here's our plan to rescue General Manuel. of exciting. You better keep up. Awaiting further orders. <laughs> Indeed. Lock and load. I've got this. My turn. Hmm. All right. Preparation complete. Concludes the briefing. Now hop to it, Claude. General Manuel is being held at the town hall. Our allies in the resistance need us to rescue him. Our objective is City Hall. You can see the Empire's made it a command post. A direct route would be risky. But my allies have infiltrated parts of this city. If you can find them, they can help you. Unfortunately, even I don't know exactly where they are. Keep an eye out for a blue rose. If you see that, it means our comrades are nearby. I'm counting on you. i 
I'll stay with you forever. I have faith in you. We'll provide support Federation you. officer. I will not fall here. Found them. Found them. Moving out. This is my fate. <laughs> 
futile. Shots fired! You. Find some cover! Calm down! Ah! We need suppressive fire now! Ah! Someone help! Roger. You die. A sniper? Has Karen been shot? Uh, I'm fine. It just grazed me. Oh. Karen, move. You're being targeted by the sniper. Find a place to hide. Yes, sir. <clears throat> How could they do this? Aiming for a medic? That's a violation of our treaty. I knew the Empire full of assholes, but these guys are really going for the grand prize. Must be under orders from this Major Burke. He's definitely living up to his reputation. If they're gonna target the medics, it's too dangerous to send in Karen. We'll have to rely on the engineer's support for now, at least until we can take out that sniper. Cheap shots won't stop us. I'm gonna save General Manuel. <laughs> Another one down. Great job! I knew you had it in you. We'll provide support too. The Vanguard. Try not to get killed. Not their lucky day. All allies have been taken. For victory! Found First it. one to pop up gets their brains blown out. Eyes up. Okay. 
Moving out. There they are. There they are. There they are. Commencing counterattack. Follow oh, my the lead. Treads. I'm on it. There they are! They're looking for the general. Found him! They're firing on us! Commencing counterattack. Target confirmed. Commencing counterattack. Follow my lead. <laughs> Didn't take much. All allies have been taken out. Genre. Right. 
figured them out. Take aim. Yeah, right. Fine. Good. That takes care of the sniper targeting our medics. We should be safe now. I'm ready to help our allies. Thank you, Commander. Can keep going. No big deal. No big deal. I need them sorted now! Thank you. Thank <laughs> you. 
<laughs> this is a nice spot. Don't miss your chance. Officer, I will not fall here. Watch out for anti tank weapons. Watch out, they're on to you. Please, you must save the general. <sighs> the darkness within. Genre. I figured them out. Target acquired. You let your guard down. Okay, moving out. Can keep going. Okay, moving out. Fire! They might be 
Genre. The Empire always finds a way to look down on us. You'll have to go. Okay, moving out. They've got you in their sight! Fire! I should have been as much as you. Here I go! Thank you. Watch out! They're on to you! Yeah, yeah. Their lucky day. No! Now it's all mine. Damn it! They got our base! Moving out! Ugh. 
Thanks. I'll make sure the engines don't freeze over. They're in range. What's that? Gotta stay calm. Were the rebels always disorganized? What are our snipers? No big deal. to get killed. Won't hurt a bit. Good. That should make things a little easier. On to the next one. In order. Requesting reinforcements. I need them sorted now. <laughs> Just watch. Officer, I will Look not out. fall here. To you. Advancing. Moving out. Keep firing! Right there! We have to save the general. You've been spotted. Watch out! Okay, moving out. Incoming! 
I'll cover you. I you. A true display of skill. All according to plan. You did it! Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you, comrade. You saved our future. No. You were the ones that saved us. Those supplies kept us going. If we hadn't gotten those... I don't even want to think about it. Oh, but we should probably save the celebrations until after the General's safe. Ah, uh, of course. Come on, let's go! Your performance in the previous battle was exemplary. Please accept this reward from headquarters. <sighs> Guess that's a wrap. All the Resistance members made it out safe as well. And the General? The interrogation was rough on him, but it's nothing life-threatening. He's safe in the car. We'll take him to our headquarters. I think it's time he joined us as our leader. I see. Glad to hear it. We can handle the rest from here. You'd better get going. You're all in a hurry, aren't you? Yeah. We need to end this war before springtime, remember? It's a promise, then. My baby's counting on you. Ah, right. You should know. If it's a boy, I plan on naming him Claude. What? I, I, uh, I don't know if I really deserve to have someone named after me. He's got a point. You don't want him turning out to be a stick in the mud like this guy. Well, if he's a stick in the mud, he'll be a tough one. And that's good enough for me. Goodbye, everyone. I wish you all the best of luck. That car, huh? Sniper! Damn it! They're after the general! <laughs> Mika! <gasps> Mika! Is he... I need to move. <laughs> Come on. These resistance guys are all just civilians, huh? No regulations to follow. No medals for their heroes. But if anyone's a hero, it was him. He ran on his own faith. We'd never have rescued the General without him. <sighs> but he had a reason to survive. You all heard him. How could he leave his baby behind? He lived a life to be proud of. He never turned away from doing the right thing. Not even when it meant death. One more reason we have to stop the Empire. We made him a promise. Yeah. Sergio, what do I do with all this cotton? Could you roll them up into little pieces? About the size of a fingertip. I soak them in alcohol for disinfecting. Okay. Those are a bit too small, sweetie. They'll have to be a little bigger than this. But you said it had to be the size of a fingertip. <laughs> I'm sorry. 
I forgot your hands are a wee bit smaller than mine. How about this? I need them the size of a hard candy. You've had those before, haven't you? Uh-huh. One of the soldiers gave me one yesterday. There you go, then. Just fill up the jar with cotton balls that size. I have to say, my job's gotten a lot easier with such a helpful little assistant. Thank you, Angie. <laughs> I wish I could stay here and help you all the time, Sergio. <laughs> I'd be happy for the help. Karen's skilled, but she's better suited to surgical matters. You'd make a fine nurse one day, if you wanted to be one. I guarantee it. I wish I could. Then I could stay with everyone forever. Oh, I'm sure you can. What's got you so uncertain? <laughs> I see. That's everyone accounted for then. Thank you for the report. The ship will be back on course soon. Do what you can to help finish resupplying and prepare to embark. So, Squad E made it back in time. Yes, just as expected. But their morale seems low right now. There were some losses suffered in the local resistance group. On the other hand, the team seems more united in their goal than ever before. I'm glad they're on our side. But I'm afraid the key to the rest of this operation is... Oh, that's one of the blocked transmission lines. It's coming from Ship One. We're being hailed by the Cavalier. Put them through, now. Yes, sir. Captain. Cavalier, too? Interlude The Witch and the Wolf. Mr. Wallace, the Resistance wanted you to have this medal. Please accept it as a token of their gratitude. <laughs> <laughs> 